Hello, this is Jeff Orker with End Up Studies. Today we're going to look at Joshua chapter 24, verse 15, but we'll pick up the context of a verse earlier because Joshua is speaking to the Israelites, and he says, Now fear the Lord and serve him with all faithfulness. Throw away the gods your ancestors worshipped beyond the Euphrates River and in Egypt, and serve the Lord. But if serving the Lord seems undesirable to you, then choose for yourselves this day whom you will serve, whether the gods your ancestors served beyond the Euphrates or the gods of the Amorites in whose land you are living. But as for me and my household, we will serve the Lord. So that's that last phrase is what we're focusing in on. So Joshua says, but as for me and my household, we will serve the Lord. And many times today, especially homeschooling households, that uh, parents are wanting to say this very verse or thinking that this verse is a great verse for them to use for their family. But this is in the Old Covenant. Israel is an unbelieving picture of the people of God. So the idea of Joshua saying that his family is going to externally do certain things, quote, in worship, uh, that may be true, but for us to say that today about our families, we can't do that. In, in our family, when our kids were younger, uh, we can say, well, mom and I are going to serve the Lord because we're real believers. The rest of you, no, you're not. We pray that you will become believers. But there is no family sort of, um, uh, family sort of, uh, what's the word, um, that we worship as a family. Well, the only way we worship as a family is if each individual member of the family has repent of their sins and embrace Jesus as their Savior and Lord. That's the only way. So we cannot say with Joshua that we will all, our family is going to serve the Lord. I can only say that if every member of my family is a true believer with a new heart and they are a God lover. Well, that's, that's it for today. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.